That feels like a really nice fish. Oh gosh, yep, yep, yep. How's it going? Good. What is up y'all? Welcome to today's video. So I am extremely, extremely excited to be fishing today because well, let me just throw it up on the screen somewhere for you. Yeah, it's supposed to be pretty good. Um, we've got a high of 80 degrees today. But the thing is, um, I'm not super optimistic that it's actually going to be as good as ratings say for bass forecast. Um, just because this is the first day of the warming trend. I don't know if the ponds are going to be heated up or not yet. I really wanted to take the kayak out today and hit some of the smaller lakes and go for some really big bass. Like, we're trying to break PBs this spring. But um, we've got about 18 mile an hour winds throughout the afternoon. So I thought, well, look, I better hit a pond today uh, the 10 foot kayak i just don't trust it out there if uh, we're getting some swells from the wind so um today we're going to a pond that holds really big bass you've seen it before y'all i've been getting skunked a lot lately that's why i hadn't been posting as frequently i've been fishing a lot i just hadn't been catching a lot so today hopefully we break that streak that bad streak and we get on some fish today stick with me what if we break a pb today go ahead and subscribe subscribe for me Hit the like button if you like this video, enjoy the content, and support me as a creator. We we're probably at about 3,000.5 subscribers um, while I'm making this. So, super excited, thanks for all the support, but let's get out there and catch some fish. All right, walking up to the spot, and yep, wind is already blowing pretty good, but it's nothing too insane. I think it'll complement us really well today on a bit of a moving bite. First things first, gotta get down here and see what water clarity looks like when we pick out our lures. Fairly dingy. Okay. All right, all right, all right. I've got a black and blue chatterbait tied on. I just don't know if that's a little too bold for these fish, so let's see how it looks in the water. Actually doesn't stand out super crazy. That's pretty overcast as well, so probably throw that around on this rod i've got a uh lipless crankbait on the other rod sriracha crawl color so that red will stand out pretty nicely as well but hopefully the fish are fired up today all right let's see how this water feels that's really not that cold okay all right must be having some warmer um evenings here but we're gonna keep it running and gunning today. I've got another pond I wouldn't mind hitting too if it doesn't work out here. Okay, this is really gonna be my last attempt to catch a fish at this pond. Wind blown corner here with some nice grass. But uh, ain't nothing epic about today so far. Bass forecast, liars. I don't know, this pond just might be dying or something. My days of relying on this one for some nice fish could be over. I don't know. That's a hog if that's a fish. Feels more like a tree no that's alive is that a turtle did I snag something bass he's just funky Woo. okay that's a good fish though maybe I just don't know what fish feel like anymore that's a good one y'all on the bank baby 
Yes! Yes! Y'all, check him out. This just uh, extended my trip today. <laughs> I was getting a little worried I wouldn't catch anything, but that's a nice one. High two, probably. Look at that. Red lipless. He's got red lips. I don't know, I hear that when they got them red lips, they could be eating crawfish. I don't know, y'all. But I do know that's a beautiful bass and I wanna get him back in since a lot of fish have been dying here recently. Let's get him back in. All right, fishy. Thank you so much. It's a pretty, pretty large mouth. Why did he fight so funny though? I don't know, but I'm just gonna kind of get him going right here. He's got some good genetics, it looks like. Could be a future eight pounder in here one day. It could just still be a little cold. Could just be a little chilly and that's why he fought, he fought so weird. I, I don't know, but I really, that didn't even feel like a fish. Like I could barely feel him moving or doing anything. Felt like I was dragging in dead weight and I got him in the mouth. I'm surprised he wasn't snagged. But right there, lipless crank. If you ain't got this red crankbait or a lipless crankbait in the spring, you're missing a lot of fish, y'all. It's one of the go-tos. So get yourself some red crankbaits and get slinging them. So I'm gonna keep going now. I mean, that motivates me. Okay, so maybe it's just a bit of a grind today. I was just steady retrieving that lipless and uh, man, he, he, I don't even know. I don't even know how to explain what happened. So odd, like I didn't react for a minute. It felt like it was a dadgum 10 pounder. <laughs> I just got wrecked. That might be a really nice fish. Okay. Yeah, I feel that feels really good, y'all. That feels like a really nice fish. Oh gosh, yep, yep, yep. Might be a PB. Might be a PB. Okay, y'all. This is why we're out here. <sighs> oh. I don't know. I don't know how big that is. I don't know. I don't, know. I don't know. That's not as big as I thought. It's a really good fish, though. That's a really, that's a really nice fish. Those northerns are deceiving. <laughs> not gonna be a PB. Not gonna be a YouTube PB. But my word! Oh my gosh! Look at that. That is a tank. Certified tank, y'all on the lipless all right I, I don't know i don't know my guess i'm gonna go it's like in the fours somewhere could be a five might be the first five younder of the year smoked it just cracked that lure mm. got the scale out okay we're zeroed look at it it's just a northern strain i mean it's such a tiny mouth for the for the body on this guy Don't mean he ain't gonna be heavy though. Hope y'all can see that. Let me dust it off my sleeve a bit. Four point, what was that, six two? Four point six two? Beast. Beautiful fish. Let's get her back in the water. ASAP. Oh my gosh. Get a look at that beast, y'all beautiful markings on her black spots i don't know if those are good for fish or bad for fish she's gonna try and get her a little bit of water okay let's send her off there she goes second or third cast right here i mean two or three casts in this spot y'all that fish cracked the crankbait I'm gonna love going back and watching that. I mean, that's why we're out here. That is why we are out here today, y'all. That was a beast. That's a pond beast. Golly. Let's keep casting. 
lipless crankbait, Guggen Squad clutch, Sriracha Crawl color. Get one, get slinging. You'll start catching some fish. Okay, the way that one hit it, I'm like, they might be getting pretty active here. Ah, oh, but I'm, I'm really wrapping up my day here is the thing. I'm on the opposite side where I started. I started right over there. I can see my car. But man, stuff keeps happening that makes me want to stay. You know, I got down to the corner way down there. It's going to turn around and go back to the car. Caught it like a two to three pounder. And now I'm right here thinking about the next spot I'm going to hit. And I catch a four and a half. That's fishing now. That is bass fishing. It's weird because I could tell it's one of those days where like if I'm getting bit, it's going to be a nice fish. All right, y'all, well, that is going to do it for today's video. I am so glad I got out there and caught some big fish. It's been a while since I've caught some nice quality fish like both of those. Caught about a three pounder, probably a little under three, and then caught that 4.6, which is my biggest bass of the year. So go ahead and hit that like button for me. Make sure you leave a comment. Let me know what you wanna see in future videos. Like now that it's warm, I got options. Like, do y'all wanna see big swim baits? Do y'all wanna see me go frog fishing? Do you just wanna see top water? Or do you wanna just see me try to catch the biggest bass possible? Or maybe just go out and have a good day of fishing. Comment what you wanna see because um, I want to make sure that I'm making content that y'all enjoy, but also content that I enjoy as well. And right now with the warm weather, like I really just enjoy being outside. So uh, it seems like it's not going to be too long before it's too dang hot here in Texas. What the heck happened? We're in spring. We're going straight to summer. It's going to be 86 degrees uh, tomorrow. Wild. But anyways, I thank you so much for all the support you were giving me and the channel. We're growing really fast, y'all. Um, and yeah, 3,000. 500 subscribers that is huge i think that we can hit 10,000 subscribers this year so let's keep it going um with all that being said i will catch y'all in the next video peace